story without having to do anything like crazy, like crazy ridiculous bumps. Mm -hmm. And it's the same thing for Richie as well. He's uh, one that we're trying to get on Triumph. Mm -hmm. Like a who only wrestles for like one promotion out of Harwich, who right. who I think is really really very very like underrated. Mm -hmm. In terms of like technical ability, and he's and he's such like a lovely guy as well. And I like I remember having like a really really fun match with him. The lads out of Harwich, yeah, I enjoyed I enjoyed my match with him. Although that was it was such a although I really even though I really really enjoyed it, it was such a shame because they had they had uh, were feeling worse for wear from the night before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I had uh, injured my shoulder taking a a DDT off the top rope. Mm -hmm. And the only healthy person in the match was Taylor, who <laughs> like was, it was stressing. Imagine out. he was stressed. Yeah. Yeah. Like <laughs> trying, to, trying to like run the show as well. And it was just like, even still, it was like still a fun match. Mm -hmm. It's still a, it's still a fun match. I like, I, I wish that we can, once this is all over, we can wrestle again now mm -hmm. like we're all like fit and healthy mm -hmm. and have like go hell for leather for sure yeah yeah that'd be cool um okay now i've kept you guys here quite a long time now just looking at the time so i'm gonna gonna bat out on the final sort of questions here but uh for both of you like when all this pandemic is is dealt with and you know like we keep saying we don't know when but what are your sort of goals? Where do you want to get to sort of like short-term goals, I guess, in terms of like, is there any promotions that you'd like to work for in the UK or any particular matchups that you'd like to have? And again, also um, mixing that over with obviously your promoter's cap on as well for Triumph Wrestling going forward. Um, what are some of the, the, the sort of goals that uh, you, what you want to accomplish? Uh, hopefully regaining some of like the bookings mm -hmm. you know because a lot of them had to be postponed and stuff we hope that these promoters can be able to put their shows back on again mm -hmm. we don't know if it's you know still happening or not but if if we are out of this by may mm -hmm. so it should be orw in clacton on may the 9th mm -hmm. i hope so hopefully Fingers crossed. we can get back by then. Mm -hmm. That's that's a really cool, like underrated promotion that's kind of come in like doing like a little resurgence. Mm -hmm. So hopefully that will be on and we can get back to having like a good summer of wrestling. Yeah. We can all get ourselves back. I think that's really just a goal is just getting back to normality. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what about for you, Jack? Um, for me, I um, 100% agree with Alyssa in terms of like, I just want to get back to like normality. Yeah. <laughs> get back to defending and, anything. and uh, winning belts, both singular and tag team. Um, mm -hmm. I'd like to... Um, I'd like to get like Triumph back on a roll again. I'd like to mm -hmm. just it's hard to like continue where we left off because it's going to be like it's going to be such like a long time since the mm -hmm. last show but um i would like to like get the ball rolling and like get the creative juices flowing and like produce some like really really good t content tell some good stories with triumph mm -hmm. uh, and in terms of like a short-term goal for this year um i would like to end the year um, with having as many good memories of wrestling as possible, mm -hmm. and I got many, many good times. Because if like you're not having fun, it's like what's the point in? Yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, yeah, no, I'm I'm with you there. I think like m the majority of people just they're not too bothered about too much. They just want to get it back on the road again. They just want to be out there performing in front of crowds uh, ultimately, which is what you want and uh, get that, that fan experience. Certainly from us, from our point of view, we are, we're looking, well, we were going to look for this year, but I, I've got a feeling it's going to be next year now is to put on our own show as well. 
and we had like thrown out a few names. We had like Rio O'Reilly confirmed and a few others. But like this is kind of like really <laughs> put put so much um, of a, a backlog on it. So we don't know. And also we had like our own. We were going to debut our own title as well. Um, that was going to be a big thing. But of course, all this is uh, all on ice at the moment. But obviously, you guys, uh, you know, we definitely want you there as well. Like you, Taylor, um, the whole package. Um, at least, yeah, yeah, of course, of course you are. I mentioned that on uh, on Instagram. Can't think yeah. of who in. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, you, you're all there. And like, and yeah, hopefully, like, again, I'm just, I just kind of want to get back out there and, doing what I was doing, you know, doing the interviews. I mean, there's nothing better than turning up at a show and watching it. Do you know what I mean? It's uh, it's what we all want to be uh, doing. And I think for fans' point of view, I do think, like, you're right. I think as soon as this is done with, I think the UK scene will be a real high demand just because we wouldn't have had had it for such a long time. Um, that I'd, I'd be, you know, really fascinated to see some of those early gates because I think that people um, would want to try and get back to gravitate to get back into something that's quite comforting to them and obviously wrestling is that for a lot of people um but um yeah uh, just before we go where can we find both you guys on all the social media stuff like where can guys um go go and check you out um all the listeners and that um i'll be found on like facebook under the drift of jack torino dash wrestler and on insta mm-hmm. uh, as uh, jack torino uh n B D. Right. <laughs> well done. Yeah, I'm on Facebook as well, just Alyssa Dawn. Uh, most active on Insta though. Definitely get me on there. That's Alyssa Dawn17. Mm-hmm. Got some underscores, but I'm sure it will pop up. And yeah. uh, you can always like type our names into YouTube and check out our matches for the views. Oh yes. Yep, too. yeah, definitely. Yeah, fun. Uh, is there a particular place to go for YouTube for that or is it just all over the place? All over the place. Yeah. All over Fair the place. Enough. Like, time and did, like, give some wrestling some love. Do you TV? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Turnbuckle TV. Very heavy on Turnbuckle TV. Yeah. And uh, obviously, uh, Triumph Wrestling. Uh, where can people go? Because, you know, I, I, like I said to a lot of my listeners before, you know, I've had some, been a part of that for at least one show. It was fantastic. Can't say enough good things about it. Um, you know, as a local promotion, giving people opportunities. You're going to get things at Triumph that I don't think you're going to get at a lot of other shows um, in terms of new starts. And you're going to see new talent um, in different varieties of matches than, than we're used to seeing. So I can't say enough good things about Triumph. Where can we find uh, that out as well? Uh, you'll find uh, Triumph on both Facebook and Insta under Triumph. Yep. And uh, yeah, exactly. yeah, like like you, we, we aim to put on matches that you wouldn't normally see i mean like mm-hmm. where else where else could you see uh simon miller lose to uh the heavyweight lewis barrett don't mention that name on here <laughs> so, <laughs> so don't mention that name on here it gets too much of a mention but i tell people this all the time you know i said look i got a little bit carried away of myself that night you know the the crowd got to me and um yeah it was a it was a genuine mistake these things can happen. You get a little bit overwhelmed. You get a little bit excited. That's what I put it down as. It was. It was. It was just an accident. Just got carried away. Definitely. Exactly. Accident. I had my own accidents that night with you know my my crutches and Rocco. And yeah, exactly. Stuff. Same thing. Same thing. I think we might have shared the common uh, whatever was going around. It was in the air. You know, Me we shared that. It's an accident. I meant to hit him as hard as I possibly could. <laughs> 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 that's real right there that's legit oh man um, people people <laughs> people that were in attendance appreciated the sound of, of me loving him very hard in the back yeah i bet um but yeah i, I want to thank you both for coming on taking time out um over this wrestlemania weekend obviously in difficult circumstances but it's been great to have you on to talk to about both WrestleMania and, and you guys' career. And, you know, I, I'm hoping that when all this is done with, we're going to we'll obviously meet up with each other and there'll be more happier times, of course, uh, back in the, in the wrestling scene again, most, uh, most of all triumph. Of course, of course. Thank you for, thank you for having us, man. And like, once, uh, more than welcome. Once, uh, 
normality happens, like we get we'll catch up with everybody down the road. I'm missing. Yeah, I'll so be good. There's ah, oh, there's gonna be ah. Oh, I'm, I'm going to handshake people. I'm again. going straight. <laughs> going straight oh. The hugs. Yeah, one that I think somebody somebody somewhere will work that into a character. I'm sure, but um, I can imagine a heel coming out of this. But um, yeah, hopefully, fingers crossed. All this, um, you know, sooner rather than later. But um, as I keep saying to everybody, please, um, you know, if you are one of the fortunate people and uh, you're lucky enough that you haven't got to be going out to work and stuff like that, please stay at home and take the government's advice. Um, keep social distancing. Hopefully, uh, this will be you know over with a lot sooner as well. Um, and uh, I want to thank everybody who's been sending their emails in as well. Uh, some nice ones. Uh, that have been sent and thank you again you two and uh, i'll look forward to seeing you further down the line thank you we'll see you soon buddy